I'm not familiar with everything that's going on with um, Kat, the glamorous life, and the people that are involved and the people that have chosen to involve themselves for whatever the reason. Um, everyone has an opinion, but there are people that have just injected themselves into it. Um, I haven't seen it at all, really. I just kind of hear about it here and there. A couple of things I have heard directly from a few mouths. Um, but I'm going to share my opinion, and then I'm going to share a fact. My opinion is that Cat is nothing like Elvis. My opinion is that Cat is not an e-beggar. Um, I was on YouTube one day, several months back. It was last year sometime. And I'm scrolling through, seeing what's posted, and I see this person that I've never seen before, ever. Never seen them. They're not on Boyd, they're not in the drama community, they're not in the in the uh, beauty community, and I clicked it. It was a live stream. And I watched this person for a while, and they were interesting. They were chatting with the side chat, and <clears throat> I didn't say anything, and then I'm watching, and then Kat comments. She says, you know, something about what the person is doing on camera, and she's like, encouraging and supportive and nice. Now the person on the stream's not asking for anything. They're kind of just doing what they do and chatting. And then Kat hit the super chat and she gave money. I'm not going to say how much, but she gave money. And the person thanked her profusely and said, oh, you didn't have to do that. That was a lot of money. And you know, she said, oh, don't you worry about it. I love watching you and this is really, you know, entertaining and I want to show you I appreciate you. Um, like I say, none of us know who this person is. I can assure you of that. And um, Kat never breathed a word about it. Now, the odd, she didn't know that I saw that. It was a minute or so, a few minutes went by, and then I popped up and said hello. And she was like, oh, my God, Corey, you know. So she knew I was in there after the fact. Um, that person didn't she never she never outed I gave money to this person I did this for this person it was someone that she just happened to enjoy she didn't brag about it she didn't use it to boast about her channel or to push her image she's never breathed a word about it I've waited she's not said a word and that I don't know how the saying goes how a person acts when they think no one's watching says a lot about their character and, of course, she knew there were people there, but the people from her community, from here, from us, weren't there. And that's what she did. And she doesn't even know that anyone saw it. Well, Kat, I saw. And I was touched by it. It, it said a lot about you that you never said for yourself. Kat has given to a lot of people. Kat has shared a great deal with people, whether they needed it or she just wanted them to have it. And some people have told me, even though they, you know, they had said they wouldn't say anything, they did. Um, and how appreciative they were of you. And now that Kat's the one that needs, she's getting judged. She's getting told that she shouldn't live the way she lives. Well, that's just the way she fucking lives. <laughs> you know, yeah, she may have squandered some money. That was her money to squander, and she certainly didn't think it was going to go away. I mean, you've got women out there whose husbands have to pay them $80,000 a month in alimony. Um, Kat could very well end up being one of them. You know, you just don't know. That's just the lifestyle that her husband had her in. He had her in that lifestyle. Now, suddenly, people want to judge her for it. You know, now she's she has hit a level that she's humble in herself. She's realizing, wow, the tables have turned. Now I need help. And she's getting ripped to shreds. I'm not going to rip her to shreds. She's not hurting me. If I don't want to give to her, then I won't give to her. And if I have money to give to her, I'm going to give it to her. And that's my business. And nobody's going to fucking shame me from doing it. I do what the hell I want to do. Uh, I just, 
people got to realize that you don't know everybody like you think you do. You see what they want you to see. And if you happen to see something that they don't know you're seeing, like I did with her, um, then you're blessed. You were a fly on the wall and you got to see something that you normally wouldn't have seen. But Kat, you have my support and I don't agree with everything that's going on right now with you. That that's your business and it doesn't affect our friendship. And I will not tell you who to be friends with. I never have, have I? No, I haven't. It doesn't affect my friendship with you. And I love you.